Hey everybody, it's Melissa Beatham and we are going to kick off your January selling season. So what we have and what we're going to be doing is going over all kinds of ideas to rock your January. We all know that January can be a really tough month. Everybody's just been hammered with Christmas presents and all these different kinds of things. What we need to do is take advantage of how we can help our our customers so it's a brand new year you know people make uh, New Year's resolutions and one of the biggest things that happens in January is that people reassess their house their schedules their routines and that's what we're going to tap into so we're just gonna jump right in and we're gonna talk about the first thing that you want to do when it comes to January I'm going to tell you that you need to do an organizing party. And you're going to say, well, I don't have anything to organize. I don't know what you're talking about. You know, it doesn't matter what you sell. It doesn't matter if you sell makeup. We need to talk about the four different areas. What I want you to focus on is four key areas that you can help them organize. So if you sold makeup, what you would be doing is tuning into the fact that, okay, let's talk about makeup on the go. What's the best little set that they can have and the best tools that they can have to take makeup on the go with them? Uh, what about makeup, uh, organizing their makeup in the bathroom? What about uh, expiration dates and how to clean their brushes and, and really start over with all that cleaning that goes on with makeup and expiration dates and things like that? Uh, so think outside the box on some different ways, four different ways that you can help your customers to kick off that new year when it comes to organizing if you sell kitchen products so let's talk about if you were a pampered chef how can you organize your pantry with pampered chef items how can you um, reorganize underneath uh, like pots and pans and things like that that's a big thing like organizing all of your pots and pans and things so I don't know what it is that you sell. I want you to post it below and I want you to think about four different areas that you could organize. If you were 31 gifts, you would have all kinds of organizing ideas when it comes to, okay, let's organize our bathroom, let's organize our kitchen, let's organize our toy room, uh, and, and do what Ever you can to come up with ideas not all of them have to be about your product of course you want to show product in there but having an organizing party is just a really fun way to spice it up and give back to your your customers and their friends by really being the expert in your field so post below what kind what are four key areas that you can think of that you could help them reorganize and get rid of the old and end with the new.